What is going on, everybody? My name is Jacob Forster. Welcome back to the room for Old Sins. We are going to finish up this game today. We have a few little puzzle pieces, and we have a few more rooms to explore. And we're almost done with uh, getting our seals completed. I guess there's three more left for us. And uh, yeah, so we have the Japanese room. We have our little art studio. It's a good handful of things that we need to explore within here. And I'm realizing, I feel like, Japanese gallery, I feel like maybe I'm almost done with the game. This might be another short video. I keep doing this with these puzzle games. I play through a certain portion of it and then I'm just like, oh no. It's much shorter for the remaining time left. But we got this piece. If you haven't seen the other episodes, obviously, camera. <laughs> Why? If you haven't seen the other episodes, make sure you go check those out. But we have uh, this mechanical cicada we're gonna go ahead and put into this little slot here. Oh, hello. There you go. Ah, okay, so what is it doing for us? This is an interesting noise. It's like Oh, look at that. That's cool. Oh, yeah, you can see some of the chain. Oh, what? Oh, that's super cool. Okay, so he's trying to grab that one and... I, I, I don't exactly know what I'm trying to do with this, but... Sure. Oh, that's super cool looking. That is super cool looking. Y anyway, I, I don't think I have the right solution for this yet. I still need to figure out something with you, but you don't fit there. But I need to put you on top. Why? <laughs> Why does my camera keep going out of focus? Um, but I have the dummy, so I feel like I need to go to the art studio first, probably. So let's jump in here, figure out what we need to do. The little art studio. All right, let's put our, our little guy over here. Nice. And what is he supposed to be doing? Basically just doing exactly what he is doing. Is there anything special with this? I don't know. Um, but apparently I'm supposed to do something with that over there. I'm guessing. So blue on the left, yellow on the right? Is that the deal? Oh, wait a second. But what is... Oh, is it looking at the window out here? Oh, it is. Oh, weird. Okay. So... Oh, gosh. Uh, well, the dummy didn't... The dummy didn't do anything for us. At least not yet. Nothing that I could tell. So let me work in here a little bit more. Try to figure out what else we're supposed to do. Because we're trying to get that. And if we slot this up here, we don't really get anything else. So we, we put this little circle here. I don't know what that's for. I can't zoom in. I don't know what the top piece is for. Something must fit on these bars. Yes, I know. I know. <laughs> strange. Very strange. Okay. So let's take this out. Thank you. And I can't interact with you further. And just to double, triple check, I cannot put you up here. Yes. Yes, we cannot put it there yet. So what am I supposed to do with the dragons then? Oh, hi. Oh! I can make him chomp. Okay, so you're gonna chomp this. And now we can go back over here and maybe break it off. Oh, that's cool. That's really cool. All right, so then you. What do I do with you? What am I chomping? <laughs> Don't know. Oh, this rotates. Oh, I got it. I got it. So we put you there. Bring the dragon down here. 
move over to it, have it chomp on down. Come back over here and... Nice. Open up a drawer. <gasps> ah, miniature pagoda roof. So that's what goes on top of the little thing that we have. Got it. Got it. Got it. Okay, you go here. So now we got the roof coming right. No. No. Oh, like that. <gasps> ah, I see, I see. Okay. Can I take it now? An unfinished pagoda sculpture. Cool. So now we can take that, and I'm assuming now we can put it on top of here. Let's try that out. Yes. <laughs> cool. Ah, the tiny one. Oh, very interesting. Ah, okay. So now they're flipping over so that I can do the same thing with the dragons now on this other side, potentially? Potentially. Potentially. Okay. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, weird. Okay. No, 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 no. Hold on. So they move in tandem now. So this one needs to chomp down first so that it won't move when I move this guy over. Now we can chomp. <laughs> and now they'll both move together as I try to lift it up. Sweet. Sweet. Okay, so what did that do then for me? <gasps> oh, it makes a little bridge. Oh, cool. I'm assuming it's the same thing on the other side? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so I need the dragons then to lower this. So it lines up right there. Got it. So hopefully now I should make the bridge and it will stay. So now we can go into the tiny puzzle, the tiny room. Figure out what we need to do here. Oh, that's so cool. That's so cool. The giant dragons in the background. Oh, I love this. I love this so much. Okay. It's trapped under the wooden latches. Yes, yes, I see. I know. There we go. I was like, how do I get closer? Okay. Got that side. And... Got that side. Now, I've got the roof inspire for it. Perfect. Oh, so cool, man. So cool. So now I can grab you. Come back over to here. Let's go ahead and place you on top. Oh, waboosh. Put you here. No, not yet. Not yet. So we need to do the, oops, the rooftop. And then I can place you on top. <gasps> ah, cool. So is that going to complete it so that the bottom will be unlocked for us? Oh, it, it just keeps getting more puzzly. It keeps getting more puzzly. <laughs> okay, perfect. I love it. I love it. Um, very interesting. So where do I start? Um. What am I? What? Huh? <laughs> okay. Um. Got it. Okay, so they connect like that. Which means these need to connect. Yeah. Which means then these can connect. And it starts moving the little pinwheel, the little fan down there, whatever you want to call it. Cool. So now we can focus on getting these going. 
got it. Bring you down, bring you up. And then we're following the red lines. So we want this to go down and up. These two want to touch each other. And then these two lines will connect to here, activating the last one. Sweet. Sweet. I love that. I love that puzzle. So cool. Oh no, my fears. <laughs> my fears are coming true. This might be a really short one. <laughs> Hopefully not. Let's just grab the strange artifact, see what happens. Ooh, the tendrils, they come! I, I, wa I really, really want to know the background for the tendrils, the, the, the backstory. Like, I know it's like the evil, it's the null, something with the null. But it's never really fully been explained, and I, and I know that's not necessarily something that is going to be explained. But it's a cool, it's a cool thing, and it's a mystery. It's very mysterious. But I want to know more of the mystery. But it's fine. Japanese gallery complete. Travelers are easy prey, seduced by the mysteries of a new world. The seal is nearly broken. But is my journey ending, or am I but one more naive traveler? Great question. Great question, my man. Well. Let's, uh, let's open this thing up. See what's inside. Oh, it's the stained glass that I needed for the mannequin. Oh, okay. Well, where do I, where do I put? Oh, it goes here. <gasps> oh, I totally forgot about that piece. Is this going to rotate now? What is happening? Yeah, okay. Got it, got it, got it, got it. So that needs to go there. Uh, what was it, blue on the left and orange on the right, I think? Oh no, it's a lot more involved because there's a pointy and there's kind of the rounded. So let's, uh, let's go in here and figure it out. Ah, okay. So pointy, rounded, pointy, rounded. Blue and then yellow. So pointy, rounded. So, there we go. So pointy, rounded, pointy, rounded. And I should be able to hopefully just go straight back into here, open this up, and go inside and figure it out. Yeah, that should be exactly how it needs to be. Um, is that not correct? Oh no, it is, because this is now. <gasps> oh, wait, what? Huh? Pointy rounded, pointy rounded. Oh. Oh, okay. No idea what I just did, <laughs> but we did it. Oh. Oh, look at that, the key just appeared here. That's so cool. Principles and fundamentals of perspective. Okay, we got a new uh, Gooby book. <laughs> the classic Gooby book. Ah! <laughs> Sorry, forgot to do it in time. The air hits me like a wall of ice. I prop myself against it and drive my legs forward. My eyes are fixed on the garden gate. My shoulder turned hard against my home. My husband, my life. I know if I look back now, my strength will abandon me. Each step comes easier than the last. I feel the madness retreat like a dispelling dream. Sense the dark creature at its heart. You may take my husband, but you will not take me. I pause with my hand on the cold iron. All within the house is darkness now. Hmm, interesting. Yeah, so the, the, the wife, key with a swan motif. The wife took the knoll from the husband, what was her name, Abigail? And uh, I don't know what she planned on doing with it, but I guess she hid it somewhere in the house, probably up here. Cool, what's in here? Oh, 
Uh, new painting. Uh, the Fibonacci swirl, whatever it's called. Is that what that is? Cool. I really like the way that they do these kind of storytelling elements. The other one was like with a uh, kind of like ethereal, like spirit people memories. This one's really cool with the story told through the paintings. So now that this is done, that should be on the floor for us waiting, is my guess. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There it is. Oh no! <laughs> Is this the final piece? <laughs> I got through this so quickly. <laughs> a strange artifact. Mm. Oh, and here come the tendrils again. Always coming for us. Always after us. This is fun. This is very fun. Alright, and the seal should break on the second to last one. So wait, what is the last seal then? Wait! It, there was still one more seal! Hold on a second. Art studio complete. I have plucked every limb from this beast. Now, only the heart remains. Ooh. Ooh, very suspicious. Okay, well, I have to open this first. See what's going on in here. What do we have? Don't tell me it's the Knoll Almond. No, it's part of a family crest. Oh, half of a family crest. Cool. Yeah. Oh, gosh. it's just, It feels like it's been forever, but I could have sworn there was a family crest in here that I got. Uh, or at least I saw some, but I don't think that's true. So yeah, this is where we started, the foyer. Then we had the, what was this, the curiosities. This was the nautical room, not called the nautical room. This was the kitchen down here. This was, oh gosh, what was this one again? It wasn't the study. Something, I can't remember. <laughs> the gazebo, the outside. This is the Japanese room. Japanese gallery. And then the art studio. So let's see what this final section is then. Cool. Very cool. <gasps> the attic. Oh, no way. Oh, no way. Whoa. Wait. So we, we were in the attic the whole time. But now we see the attic as it truly is. Wait, hold on. This is wild. <laughs> this is wild. Okay. Abigail, if you are hidden, reveal yourself. Perhaps together there is still hope. Never again will I threaten you. I feel better now. I can see clearer. The house is not itself. I'm leaving a trail of notes, but they amount to little help. Occasionally I stumble on a note I swear I have yet to write. If you see me, tell me to stop and rest. You were always the one who made me rest. Edward. Interesting. Very interesting. Let's let's look around the house before I like actually try to go into one of these things. Hi. Okay, so Abigail is at the front here. And was Edward? Is at the rear. In his, oh yeah, it was just the general like lab. I forget what it was called exactly, but hold on, is there is there more I can look at in this actual house? And what? Where am I? I'm on like some strange plane of existence where there's just stuff flying outside. Like in, I'm in the center of a hurricane or a tornado. Okay. All right. Well, let's go to Abigail, I guess. Hi. Wait, what do I... How do I do this? 
Um, interesting. Is this where the, no, the family crest doesn't go here? Hold on, let's go back to you. Wait a second. Oh, 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 look at that. Oh, that's so cool. So now he'll be at the front. Yeah. He said, you're always asking me to rest. <gasps> Abigail, no. I wonder what happened to her. Oh, no, we're going deeper into the attic? <laughs> All right, let's go again. <laughs> so cool. The attic. Oh, yeah. All right, it's getting even more destroyed, more crazy. Oh, this is cool. This, oh, this is so cool. All right, let's, let's go. Let's check this out. Abigail, doors open to brick walls. Stairs lead nowhere. The house shifts and coils. I have searched this labyrinth for days. Always, I am led back here, as though there is still something I am learn, I am to learn from these walls. You are right. You are always right. If you find a way, do, way out, do not hesitate to take it. Do not wait for me. Do not look back. I am forever yours, Edward. Okay, so he's still here again. We got a couple symbols. And there's another symbol here, and then she's over here. So basically, all the puzzles that we're figuring out at this point is how to get Edward back to Abigail, yes? That sounds about right. Okay. Oh. Oh, interesting. Okay, so you can shift where you would like him to go, it would seem. So either to the kitchen or to the front. I'm gonna bring you to the front, I would think. Seems like the better option, right? So now I'd like you to go. So that's the kitchen again. Sure, let's go to the kitchen. A bit confused on this one. Uh, so how do I get you here? Oh, here we go, kitchen. Yeah, 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 yeah. This will lead you to Abigail. The curiosity room is where this is going. Ah, here we go. Is she gonna disappear again? She is. Does that mean we're gonna go straight into the attic once more? We are. Oh, cool. Cool. All right, let's do it. I still have this crest piece, half of a crest piece, that I still need to figure out what to do with. <laughs> the attic, even more wrecked and destroyed. Dude, this is so cool looking. <laughs> it's so cool. All right, let's check out the note. The books, they are filled with our thoughts, the entire library, month upon month of our lives. I've witnessed my own madness firsthand. The ramblings run for pages. I see now how terrible it must have been. I have read a book about me reading the book I am reading. Strange sensation. I know that you are no longer here. I have read your escape. Thank God you are safe. My remaining hope is that one day you will return to find and read my apologies. I will keep writing you for as long as I am trapped in this hell. I am sorry, Abigail. I am sorry. Hmm. Okay, so... So no one is here yet. Abigail is down here. So I need to get, uh, I need to get our friend, whatever his name is, uh, to the main uh, foyer. So where 
first should we be going? To the kitchen, maybe? Or... Let's go to the kitchen first. Let's see where this takes us. Okay. Kitchen, then, to the... Oh, I don't know what room that is. So, let's see, let's see. <gasps> the nautical room. I need to get him to the nautical room. Which is... Oh, where's the nautical? Is that this one? Yes, it is this one. Okay. Got it, got it, got it. No, this is perfect. So go to the... Is that correct? I hope so. It showed him there. <gasps> no, it's not correct. Crap, where did he go? <laughs> where are you? <laughs> ah, dang it. Yeah, put him right back here. Is that the nautical room? <gasps> that is the nautical room. Okay. Send him there. Okay. Go to the nautical room, and this should send to the... Oh, no! Wait, no, how do I... Crap. How do I get you here to the foyer? Because that's not the foyer. That's the kitchen. And that's the curio... The, the, the curio room... Wait, maybe I need to bring him to the curio room, which is this one. No, because that goes back to the kitchen. Gosh, I'm trying to figure out what combination I need to do to get you back to the living room. Okay, uh, I guess I'll send you to... I guess I'll send you to the kitchen. <laughs> to the kitchen you go! <laughs> This is a this is a a strange little little puzzle I'm trying to figure out. Okay, send you there. And then where are you now? Okay, you're back up here. That's the kitchen again. And that's the the nautical room. <laughs> Dang it! <laughs> oh! Oh, I didn't even see this up here. <gasps> oh, okay, so she's in the attic currently. Oh! Oh, hi. <gasps> oh! Oh, 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 yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, we got it, we got it, we got it. So I need to send you... Not here. Okay, back to the kitchen. <laughs> Sorry, I'm all switched up. This should lead to the curio room now. Yes? No? No, that's the nautical room! I, I'm trying to like look in there and see. Okay, to the nautical room, I guess. That's the kitchen. There we go, there we go, there we go. <laughs> we're figuring it out. We're, we're doing it, everybody, we're doing it. Okay, you're there. So now I can send you to the foyer. Here. Got it? And then from the foyer, I can send you to the attic with Abigail. There we go, there we go. And once more, she disappears. Okay, we're going to the attic again. <gasps> but things... At least the structure is good, but the... <gasps> the goop is covering it all. 
Oh. No. He's gone. Edward. <gasps> Family crest. I can search no longer. There's no point. I'm a rat in a cage, but only now do I finally see the bars. You saw Abigail. You saw through it from the start. You felt it worm its way through the house, our marriage, our lives. The dollhouse. You fed it the dollhouse. Quite brilliant. It is you, the circle, should have engaged, not I. Fly free, beautiful Abigail. I am sorry, my dear. I am sorrow. Yours, Edward. Oh, Edward, no. Poor Edward. He's just gone. <laughs> well then. It seems as though the family crest is the last piece of this puzzle right up top. Let's take just a quick glance around this dollhouse. No, it doesn't seem to be anything else. So let's go here and put the pieces in. Ah, the null element, I'm sure. Hopefully. This looks like a Metroid upgrade <laughs> from Metroid Prime. All right, let's, let's grab it. The null. Perfect. So what do I do with the null then? Oh, no. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's so cool! <laughs> oh, look at that. Just transformed back into a standard little dollhouse. So curious. So very curious. Mm. Is this like a special holder just for the null? Oh, that was cool. It's like a little Ouroboros snake head. Oh, it is, yeah. Specialize? All right, let's put it in. Lock it up tight. Cool! Oh, that's so cool! Cutscene, let's go. Oh, is this the circle? This has got to be the circle. And that's us, I guess. It's like only coming through my left headphone, which is bizarre. I don't know why. Oh, wow. They've got a lot of vanilla. What is up with this weird secret society? Ah, game complete. Congratulations, you have completed the Room 4 Old Sins. You navigated the labyrinth halls of Waldegrave Manor and overcame the trials within, escaping with the Knoll sample intact. My employers have the soul they desired. Mr. Lockwood's frustrated ambition made him perfect prey, but Miss Lockwood is another matter. Seems it was the fate of all involved to underestimate her resolve. Even my employers cannot trace her. One who can evade the circle is one who must be found. Collector Report, 21st of November, 1908. Thank you for playing The Room 4. From everyone here at Fireproof Games, we worked hard to give our players a fresh glimpse into the room universe, and we sincerely hope you enjoyed this fourth game in the series, meticulously updated for PC. As an independent developer, we like to your feedback and recommendation. So if you like our games, and please consider leaving a review. We sincerely value your support and any feedback you can give us. Super cool. Yeah, I guess this game, if I'm not mistaken, it was originally released in, I think, 2018 or 2019. Um, and then this updated version, I think, came out in 2020 or 2021. Uh, a lot of these room games had a, uh, um, like, a remaster, if I'm not mistaken, for Steam. Um, and that's why they look so great for being, quote, unquote, older games. But uh, the Room VR, I think that one came out within the past uh, couple years. So that's technically the next one in the series. Um, 
but it doesn't necessarily, f from what I read, it doesn't necessarily follow the, s the same story. Um, you don't really need to play the other room games. Again, I'm, I'm con still considering playing. I'm gonna, I'm gonna test run it with my VR headset and set up, see if it actually like ends up being good or not. Because again, I, I don't want to give you guys a, a half kind of crappy VR gameplay that like it's hard to watch, like it's too shaky or like it's just kind of all over the place. You don't really get to see my, you know, all you see is like my <laughs> my mouth if I have the VR headset on. So I feel like it's not as exciting. Like you don't get to see the emotion that's coming from me and seeing everything that's going on. Again, I'll, I'll experiment with it. I've done some VR games in the past and traditionally it did really poorly, just to be perfectly honest. Um, so that's, that's why I'm hesitant to be like, yeah, I'm gonna play the room VR. I really want to, but I just, I don't know if it's gonna work. We'll see, we will see. But outside of this, uh, now that we've finished with The Room, again, minus VR, a um, lot of games kind of on the dock that I'm interested in checking out. Amnesia The Bunker came out, which was supposed to be really, really good. Um, and I'm interested in checking that out. It's on Game Pass, which is super nice. There is obviously uh, I mentioned in a previous video, I do want to play through The Witness at some point. And in terms of other puzzle games, I think there's some other like smaller games that I was kind of eyeballing. I've seen a few re game recommendations on my Discord and uh, in some of the comments here that I'm going to kind of take a take a take a look at and see if it seems interesting to me to play. But um, yeah, all that to say, there's a there's a lot of stuff on the dock, a lot of stuff up and coming. Very excited to continue sharing all this stuff with you. Thank you again for everybody for the support for all the puzzle games and for all these different game series that I've been doing. And it's really, really, uh, I'm just really honored that uh, everybody comes along and is here to check out these these games that I play. And for these long playthroughs and everything, just my style that I do this in, uh, it's really cool to see so much support for, for what I do here. But anyway, hope you all enjoyed this video. If you did, Make sure you hit that like button. Leave a comment down below. Love to hear any thoughts and feelings from you all. And if you're not already subscribed, consider doing so. Hit that bell notification that we know exactly when I'm uploading any new videos. And if you'd like to see any more content from me, you're welcome to follow me on any of my other socials like my Twitch, Twitter, Instagram. I got a Discord channel and a bunch of other cool things always listed in the description down below. But of course, that all being said, you all are awesome. You all are amazing. And I cannot wait to see you all in the next video. Later.